Hey everyone, welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, where on the last episode uh, we dealt with uh, some strangely calm, dismembered people who were locked in a basement. Or one dismembered, well, one partially dismembered, one fully dismembered. Um, so, as I recall, we now have a few things uh, that need cleaning up. Uh, a few missions here and there. Um, and a few probably long-term missions that need to be uh, pushed into the next period. So, we need to go to Foxy Boxes. Um, I've also, I, I realize that I'm really not making great use of my vampire abilities. Um, partially it's, I, I'm going to excuse myself on the basis of it being, you know, uh, the controls being a little wonky or antiquated or whatever word you want to use. Um, but I'm certainly not helping myself by never having any blood. Um, so I could try and drain some blood out of somebody in a, um, in an alleyway or something. Uh, and I might give that a go, but frankly, given how much money I have, I might as well just uh, drink some blood packs instead. Might just be easier. I'm looking for somebody in, a, in an alcove somewhere I can drain. But I don't know if that's going to happen. Um, so... Let's just do that instead. Wow, that doesn't fill it that much. Hmm, okay. Well, good to know anyway. All right, Foxy Boxes is here. So let's uh, give this a go. It's funny how lo how fast this loads, even though it's it's not it's not on my SSD. It's just fast. Where did I come in? Here? This place is surprisingly quiet. Reports. Man, this this game would probably be a hell of a lot harder if I didn't have my hacking skill up. Um, I wish I didn't have to type these out every time. 10, 12, 04. Port 1, my initial observations of the city indicate that the Canites are both scattered and unorganized. There are three individuals of note, but they seem to be involved in some sort of dispute. I shall continue to watch and listen. 10, 18, 04. These Canites are curious and fragile, are a curious and fragile race. They waste the gift of their immortality on petty scheming and fleshy gain. We will have little problem making this city our own. Canites is like sort of close to canine, and I'm wondering if that's a term they're using for um, the werewolves. 10, 21, 04. It seems that my presence here has been noticed by one of the canites, a Nosferatu. Oh, okay, never mind then. Unless they're related. That's the thing, I don't know enough about this universe to know how um, vampires and werewolves are or aren't related and feuds and all that. I believe they are called, as I believe they are called. Hmm, yeah. One of the canites, a Nosferatu, I believe they are called. He has entrusted the responsibility of my surveillance to a bumbling mortal fool. Yeah, that pretty much describes him. Um, I have become to, I have begun to follow the so-called spy, a small amusing respite from my usual duties. I have drawn the attention of a newcomer, an agent of the prince, who has discovered the corpse of Virgil Crumb. Oh, that's me they're talking about. I have... I know very little about this individual, but they seem much more resourceful than most canites I have observed. I will prepare myself in the event that our paths cross. 
because an altercation seems imminent. If I do not survive, let my last report state that Santa Monica is ripe for the taking. We'll find little resistance if we come in force. Hmm. Okay. Whoops. What was... Enter. Enter swings my fists. Good to know. Um... Okay, what was I coming in here for? There was, uh, I got a key for this place, right? So is it just a gen, oh. Well, that guy looks vaguely Asian. Oh, come on, really? That's, that's not even in an introduction, you're just gonna. Oh, I still have that arm. Let's see, where did you go? Wow, he... Uh, that hurts a lot. Um, oh, this is not good. I mean, just trying to figure out what to do. I mean, it's not good. Fuck. This is not going well. And I can't switch. You've suffered final death. Well, all right. First death of the game. Load this up and give it another go. <laughs> Ow. Just my leg hitting the desk. Nothing to worry about. Is that something on the table? No. Um, okay. So let me actually prepare myself this time. I can't believe I can't buy firearms from that guy. That's really upsetting. Um, hmm. I don't really know what these do either, so. Hmm. Well. God, how? He's doing so much damage. This doesn't seem fair at all. continues to go poorly. See, that's that's the problem. As a Malkavian, I'm not really in any way equipped for this. I also don't really understand the combat system in any reasonable way, so that's not helping either. Can I just chug blood?
Yep. Okay. Oh, I'm already healed up. I got healing from the um, from the blood. I guess if I ever used these abilities, I would know that probably. Well, this is suddenly going better because he was caught unaware. So I guess maybe the trick is just to not, you know, not take him head on, confuse him. Can I confuse him? I, I sort of assume that games from this era, the AI is either incredibly dumb or, like, uh, omnisciently smart. I seem to be mostly right. Ow. Dickhead. Where did he even go? I should really look up the controls. I should have taken better advantage of that. The, like, lack of music is kind of funny. Although, when I put up the last round of videos, of course, there's very little music in this game. But what little there is, uh, which is pretty much only in the club, is extremely copyrighted. Ah, come on. How did I use all of that blood so fast? I wasn't even paying attention to it, which is not good. I wish I could track him better. It's sort of why I wanted to use Auspex, but... Boss fight sucks. Climb the ladder. Fuck. <sighs> One more try. And then I'll finish it off screen instead. I should actually look at the stats on these things. Hold on. Get a minus two, minus one, minus two, minus four. Oh, I should just be using my fucking fists, apparently. Boy, I guess I'm an idiot for thinking that a baseball bat or a tire iron will be better than my fists. <laughs> well, that'll show me.
Hold on a second. I could probably also be stealthing on him as well, which would be to my benefit. Yeah, see, this is way fucking easier if I just fucking punch him. I think this game may be a little, uh, a little fucked up in terms of its balancing. I shouldn't be able to do twice as much damage at twice the rate with my fists. This suddenly became a joke because I read some stats. I mean, the stagger alone is saving me a hell of a lot of time. The only downside is I don't seem to be able to hit him on the ground as easily. God. Yeah, that became a joke. Huh. <sighs>